Hello again, Kasia from Poland. Hello again, hi, how are you? You've been so busy traveling, so you were in Latvia last week, mm -hmm. now you're in London. Yeah. And tomorrow I'm going to Tel Aviv, uh, then I'm flying to Kiev for one day, and then I'm going to Amsterdam, then I'll be uh, in Poland for one week, and then Madrid. So the I'm full, happy. the full tour, basically, yeah. <laughs> yeah, the whole tour, like yeah, my European tour. <laughs> so, um, do you want to talk to us about your song again? Mm -hmm. Because um, it sounds really good live. We saw you in Riga. So, what's the quick introduction to your song? Um, uh, the song "Flashlight" was uh, co-written with uh, myself, Pete Barringer, and Ricard Bontremel, actually in London. And we worked together for two days, and uh, the song was creating on the second day of our, uh, of our, yeah, uh, of our. Con co was it like a boot camp situation where you lock yourself into a studio? Yeah, it was yeah. Like that. We created two songs, and uh, it was kind of boot camp. So we, we made a song from the beginning <laughs> to the end. We we recorded vocals and everything in one day. So it was really amazing. And uh, so I'm very, I really like the song and I'm yeah. so happy that we, we, we made it. The song gave me the opportun opportunity to be here today. And you know, this is like, I'm, I'm feeling that I'm, I, I'm fulfilling my dreams. From, yeah, so it's amazing. So um, what's the best thing about uh, Eurovision for you? The best, uh, the best for me is that I can actually meet so many wonderful people, so many wonderful artists, and I, we can share our music. And it's also amazing that I can actually present my music to the viewers, not only from my country, but from the people from different countries. And this is like, I always wanted to share my music uh, with people from from abroad. So, yeah. so this is amazing, really. Can we get to know you a bit more? So in your private life, what do you get up to? What are your hobbies? How do you spend your weekends? Okay, I'm spending my weekends basically like walking with my walking with my dogs because I have five dogs and two cats. They're all from <laughs> animal shelters or I'm taking them from the from the street. So they're like, like wonderful. Yeah. We like to go uh, into the woods and you know, just uh, walk with them. And we also have a uh, like the some the camper that his name is Havranek and we are like taking uh, we we do a like van life okay. so I really 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 enjoy to uh, to go to the different places and yeah. sleep in our car and you know spend time in uh, in nature I was going to say it sounds very much like a nature yeah, type yeah, uh, nature, pastime really. uh, since I was a child I, we we were my, my family were was organizing uh, uh, like the Camps for like scout, like scout, scout camps. Okay. So I spend a lot of time in a, in a, in a, you know in the camps under the tent. <laughs> so. Do you do any sports other than that? Mm, you know I like to uh, mm, I like to play uh, volleyball. I also like to uh, swim on the boats. You know with the and also uh, kayaking. Kayaking. Yeah. yeah. Is it the right word? So yeah, I really like this. I, I really like sports. I really like to spend time uh, in nature, in yeah. water. So. so let's go back to your vision. Um, are you happy with, with your semi-final position for Poland? I'm um, 11. Uh, you know, I think Thoughts? so. You, no. Yeah, I think. Uh, I don't think it's like uh, it doesn't matter on which like uh, position you are. It, you have to give the best uh, out of you like the best performance I I want just to be vocally uh, as best as I can be and I just want to be proud of myself and don't have any regret after that I could do something yeah. of course you always can do something better and of course of course you, you you think that you should do something different differently but uh, but I just want to be you know uh, I don't want to be so stressed about it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I just want to and I think that the fact you're going to these various preview parties mm -hmm. uh, is helpful, isn't it? Yeah, I think so. It, it, it helps a lot that we can actually sing for a lot of uh, for a lot of people. And I think it's also be very good that we're going to have a lot of rehearsal there in Kiev. So yeah. uh, I've heard that Monika Kuszynska said that when she Monika, oh, yeah, our Monika. friend. Yeah, I love her. Yeah. You know that we have the same manager, actually. I, I, no, I didn't know that. Yes, we have Kasia. Kasia, my manager is also oh, her manager. Do you know, my heart goes out oh, to Monica. Okay. We love her. <laughs> okay, so wonderful. I will. Uh, Can you say hi to her from us? Oh, of course I will. Of course I will. So she said that 
because of uh, she had so many rehearsals then then when she went to this on the stage like on, on the main uh, performance she was like okay another one okay i can sing whatever so i just hope that i'm gonna feel the same yeah and that performance in vienna oh my god that was so good 2015 in vienna monica kuczynska <laughs> yeah yeah kuczynska she's so and she's such a humble person and such a nice girl so i love people like that well, do you know what? It's so nice of you um, to, to talk about another artist because I think a lot of artists talk about themselves. So it's quite nice to, you know, refer to other people sometimes. I'm trying to not be just focusing on myself. Uh, in my life, I'm focusing on animals and about their uh, welfare. And uh, so, yeah. so Kasia, thank you so much. Thank and you. we're standing here in Leicester Square. I do hope you enjoy London. Thank you so much. Thank yes. you. And thank you for interviewing me. And say hi to Israel. Uh, say hi Israel, hello, see you tomorrow! <laughs>